Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Stardust here. Welcome back to another video here on the YouTube channel. And I'm in a little bit of a down spirit because, as you can probably tell, my microphone sounds the same. Um, the reason being for this is because the uh, what I actually got was defected, which is brilliant. Um, but Marvel's Avengers released some patch notes and we're going to go through them a little bit. See, uh, see what's on here. So we've got Reassemble Campaign Avengers Initiative. Um, nothing sort of major here, but I will read through them regardless. In the Discord and Sam Raid, during the claw fight with Zawavari, the platforms that appear when claw is down no longer leave invisible areas of collision. In the Discord and Sam Raid in the first jungle area, enemies no longer spawn in rocks or stairs. In the Discord and Sam Raid in the final indoor area, the vibranium exposure debuff now fills the entire area, so flyers cannot avoid it. Okay, fair enough. In the Discordant Sound Raid, the Command Crawler no longer stands completely still if it's hit by Kamala's hand while she's holding on to another enemy. In the Discordant Sound Raid, an extreme amount of echo portals no longer appears on some occasions. See, I actually think that's a bit of an L because, I mean, uh, I mean, uh, fair enough, but like, I think that's kind of cool. I kind of liked it, to be honest, but I can understand some people on like PS4 and that, and uh, like the old Xbox probably went a bit mental. Uh, in the Discordant Sound Raid, enemies after the door button area no longer get trapped, which previously prevented progress. Okay, good. In the Discordant Sound Raid, fixed an issue where players couldn't move with an Iron Man summons a Hulk Buster right as the elevator opens up to the control room. Didn't even know that was a thing. In the Discordant Sound Raid, in the door button area, players use emotes or range attacks, their buttons no longer activate. Okay. <laughs> Griefing with the emotes, boys. Griefing those buttons. Uh, mouse animate correctly in cutscenes after completing the amazing Spider Man mission chain. Fix an issue where any hero can complete Spider-Man's Cosmic Threat Web Bomb Heroic Objective. Okay. Uh, multiplayer and matchmaking. In the score and sound raid and control Mary with Shuri, if all players are on the outer area with no way back in, they will now be properly teleported back in. I mean, that's that's pretty cool. I'd like to see what that looks like. In the score and sound raid, players no longer spawn behind a wall after completing the control room if the host migrates during the loading screen. I mean, at that point, you might as well just leave anyway. <laughs> um, art and animation. Okay. Black spheres no longer appear when Iron Man has Mewon or Missile uh, reverberation, rev reverberation. Jesus, gear equipped. The camera now follows Iron Man correctly when he uses his takedown on the Hunter Crawler and here comes the pain. Uh, this is all Spider-Man based. Spider-Man can no longer wall crawl on invisible walls. I, I didn't know he could do that. Spider-Man's underground suit size now match the icon where it glows white instead of red. Uh, that's a shame. Suit effects are present when Spider-Man tries to pick up Molnir on the Helicarrier. Uh, that'd be interesting. Uh, I'll probably I'll have a listen. To, I mean, it would just be the Thwip, wouldn't it? So, uh, Spider-Man's Mark Four. Is that that's a four, isn't it? Oh, I'm stupid. Outfit no longer clips during idle animations. Spider-Man's wrestler outfits hoodie no longer clips near the bottom. Decent. User interface. Uh, game no longer becomes unresponsive when dismissing the gear upgrade story of the shipments. Yeah, that was a bit mental. Essentially, if people were a bit confused. <laughs> it was like to the tutorial was saying, no, stop. You know what I mean? It was it was really odd. Um, various text improvements for Spider-Man skills and perks. Uh, when Hunter Echoes are invisible, their rocket attacks are now visible. Okay. Using Black Panther's King Mercy in the underground area and beating the odds where you need to defeat three prime adapts in so it's no longer sends enemies through the door. That's that's a Kate issue as well. Like Kate with her pinning does that too. Uh, okay, so this is the thing that a lot of people were sort of like complaining about. And I wanted to touch on this a little bit. Uh, co comic bonuses related to armor lowered to prevent players from retaining 100% armor, which negated all damage. The tiers used to be 1.1%, 12%, 13%, 14%, 15%. They are now 1%, 2%, 3%, 4%, 5%. Um, I get it. I do understand why they've done this, obviously. But I think what they need to do is they need to give you an opportunity to actually farm comics properly. Like, as in, you know, specific areas of comics, I believe that they could rotate the entire map, like the entire war table, to have different specific comics at a specific notice. That'd be kind of something cool. We're moving the camera horizontally during Spider Man's web launch ability. The screen no longer shakes upon landing. Spider Man's hit the sky skill properly increases melee damage while airborne. When Spider Man touches to a wall, begin wall running no longer goes straight up and instead in the direction of the controller. Thanks! <laughs> Gear challenges and rewards. Okay, so there's a specific one, and it's uh, Spider-Man's drone thing, which I really hope they fix. I'm looking forward to seeing this. When upgrading gear, the correct amount of, yeah, okay, whatever. With Spider-Man's balanced reverberation perk, rapid spin now properly deals vibranium damage. Okay, with balance, it now properly deals sonic damage. 
Spider-Man's Wrecking Ball Overdrive Perk now properly grants the right amount of wreckage regeneration. Okay, so that so they didn't fix that yet. Brilliant. Uh, in this school doesn't sound right. The Sonic Barrier does not show up in the first button section. Halt in progress. We're still in... They still have not fixed that. Wow. Okay. That's kind of crazy. Fair enough. Um, various crash and hang issues during the raid and OLT. Okay. In the Discord and the Sound Raid, the Commander Crawler's webs visually appear on Strike Team members even after they've broken out. That's not a big issue. I appreciate them for fixing it, obviously, but it's not something I'm like, go fix it, please. Uh, buttons are sometimes inaccessible during the raid. Uh, I've not faced that myself, but obviously, like, it's an issue, right? Then we'll put it on there otherwise. But there you go. So there's the patch notes for today. Um, no MCUK now. <laughs> so it is what it is. Uh, but let me know what you guys think about the patch. I'll leave the link down below. And I'll see you guys in a bit. Peace.